What's going on? What's going on? How everybody doing this fine day? Welcome. Uh, Coach <laughs> Untamed Friday Night Wilson. Uh, this is my top 50 draft prospects. And to my left, hey, I'm welcome guests. Auntie Pam's in the house. What's going on, Auntie Pam? I'm doing good. Hello, hey. everybody. Hey, hey, hey. Like I said, I don't know who's going to jump on the chat with us, but me and me and Miss PJ are going to do this ourselves today, y'all. We don't care about us today. All right. Let's do so, it. So today is going to be that day. I'm going to talk about my top 50. You guys may have another top 50, but this is who I see going to be the top 50 people that's going to get drafted. They may not, they're not going to go in order. I don't have the top 50 in order, but I just got names. Uh, these 50 people here are going to be drafted. I say they're going to be the top 50. I may be 90%. I may be 80%. But these guys here, are, are, I feel, are going to be drafted in the top 50. So I got like six quarterbacks that's going to be going in the top 50. I got 14 old linemen. Hear me. 14 old linemen. Wow. In the top 50. I'm not saying who's going to be first round, second round. I'm just saying. I got 10 wide receivers in the top 50. I think I got seven edges, I think, seven DBs, one tight end. That's a damn shame, one tight end. <laughs> I think I know who the tight end is. <laughs> and I got some um, D linemen. So it's going to equal up to 50 people. So the numbers could be off, but we go ready to roll. Y'all ready to do this? Ready. Let's do it because I'm ready. But it's going to be some, like I said, going to be some names that's left off. You guys don't. You know, I, I really don't care. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do, like I said, what I'm gonna do today, I'm gonna give you some. I'm not gonna give you a lot of stats. I may give you a couple of stats on certain people, like um, the first couple of people. Mm -hmm. But um, I'm gonna give you their measurables, their weight, and their age in the school they came from. Mm -hmm. I'm not. We don't got an hour, so mm -hmm. that's 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 rock and roll. Oh, I, oh, by the way, let me introduce my people in the chat. I forgot that too. Sherman yeah. Wood, what's going on? Tay Thanks, bro, Brian. Matt Town dirty, smooth C seventy eight. He stood me up a couple weeks ago. He didn't want to do that <laughs> draft on me, so that's okay. <laughs> Dre Murphy, what's going on? Miss Sonya Howe, and uh, Georgia Texas boy, what's going on? Well, we picked number forty three in the second round, Dre Murphy, for number forty three. Like I say, this is in no order, so don't don't get it confused. I'm just giving my top fifty people. I did this off, off of them because I was like, okay, there's 50 people. Let me just write these names down. So I wrote all these names down and I did a little, what you call it. So, all right. Let's get started, man. First person. First person. Here we go. <laughs> I'm going to share the screen with you. Mm -hmm. All right. Caleb Williams. Mm -hmm. uh, quarterback USC. Transferred from Oklahoma. Uh, 6'1", 215, age 22. Hometown. Washington, D.C. <laughs> All right. This young man right here had 3,600 yards last year. He had a 68.6 .6 completion rate, 30 touchdowns, five interceptions, and a quarterback rate of 118. Not bad. So, like I said, he's my first. I ain't going to say my first one on the board, but he's he's my number one guy. I, I just go that way. All right. All right. <laughs> Next. We got Drake. Yeah, another quarterback. Drake Mays, another quarterback. Let me take that off right there. Drake Mays. I want to see what's talk about Drake. What did he do last year? I got all these people right here. All right, Drake Mays. When he last year, did I get his numbers? I had the number somewhere. Anyway, hang on, worry about the name. <laughs> oh yeah, here it is. I got. I just got to look for it. I got stuff everywhere. It's crazy. Anyway, he's uh, 6'4". I ain't know who that tall. He's 6'4", 220. He's a big kid. 229 mm -hmm. pounds. Age 21, hometown. Huntsville, North Carolina. He ran a 4'6", So, not bad for a QB. And like I say, he had a decent year last year. One day, you know, one of the super numbers that people expected, but he did okay. He had uh, 3,600 yards. 63.3 uh, completion rate, 24 touchdown, nine interceptions. So that's my 
third down and one. What is it? He said, uh, I make it he said, Coach, oh, okay, then what's up right there? Thank you so much for answering my question. I appreciate you. Good hi, hey, man. You know, mm-hmm. I try to answer, and I'm going, I'm going. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes I, I ain't gonna lie. Sometimes I forget about the chat, man. I start talking, I forget about the chat. I gotta get not do that so much. <laughs> All right, my number three person, number I said, number three. It's the number three. Person, yeah. The third person I have on here is. Jane Daniels, quarterback LSU, transferred from Arizona State, 6'4, kind of thin, 210, 23 years old, hometown, San Bernardino, California. I've been there. Mm-hmm. So, but yeah, Jane, he's going to be that surprise guy, man. So, y'all got to be careful this kid. He, he could be the surprise pick, I think. So, yeah. He's going to be something going to be tricky with him. I hate to say it, something going to be very tricky. This kid had a. He had a great quarterback ring. He had a 146 quarterback ring. That's, that's excellent. He was the highest of trophy winner, too. Yeah, highest of trophy winner. Yep. 3,800 yards, 72 point, man, that's a good completion, 72.2 completion rate. Mm-hmm. Uh, 40 touchdowns, four interceptions. But then again, look at his wide receiver. So, nah. Yeah. <laughs> that ain't going to hurt you either, having those good wide receivers <laughs> like that. So, all right, who's my next guy? All right. That's seven minutes. We get four. Okay. Move, 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 move. <laughs> All right. Who's next? Marvin Harrison Jr. Yeah. The son of a Hall of Famer. Senior Harrison Jr. Marvin. So uh, this kid is Ohio State wide receiver, 6'4, 205 pounds, age 21, hometown, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. So. That's not bad for a young man. Mm-hmm. Let's see what we got. Let's see what's get at. He's a wide receiver. Uh, Marvin Harrison, how was his number last year? I have him somewhere here. I got all these things and I got to try to look for this stuff all the time. He <laughs> has 67 receptions, uh, 1,211 yards, 14 touchdowns, That's good time. and uh, average 18.1 yards a catch. Uh, that's not bad. Dre not Murphy bad got another, yeah, Dre Murphy got another question. He, he said, um, mm-hmm. you see Washington Commanders going with another North Carolina Tar Heel quarterback after Sam Howell? Or you, or do you think they'll take Jaden Daniel? He personally, I think they'll take Jaden. I think so, too. I think they take Jaden. Yeah, I do, too. I do, too. So, mm-hmm. that's just, that's just what I, hold on, what he's saying here. Man, y'all talk about folks when, okay, that's what's up right here. Uh-huh. What about ready for 420 tomorrow, though? I guess. Oh, <laughs> that's y'all thing. <laughs> I know. I know. I'm, okay. I'm, I drive by a lot of dispensaries because we've got a whole bunch of them here watching, right? They have having parties tomorrow. They got taco trucks, food trucks all around. All, every one of them I've been by today, they have a big celebration tomorrow. Half uh-huh. price on everything they sell there. And they have these trucks. That, man, they, they, these people they go crazy for that stuff. <laughs> that's their business. All right, next person. <laughs> we got the Leak Neighbors wide receiver LSU. Six foot. I thought he was taller, but he's only six foot, two hundred one pounds, age twenty. Hometown, Youngsville, Los Angeles. What's your thing about Malik? Miss- he's, he's he's definitely a good receiver and. Um- and that's proving why Jaden Daniels um got the Heisman Trophy winner yeah. because on the, the re- receiver. So, oh yeah, so, yeah. This kid had eighty nine receptions, fifteen hundred and sixty nine yards, which is a lot. Uh, mm-hmm. Fourteen touchdowns. He averaged seventeen point six. Uh, yeah. A re- uh, reception average. Mm-hmm. All right, Miss PJ, I'm gonna let you read this next. You ready? Uh, okay, I'm ready. Can you see it? There's yeah. the next person right there. Uh, J.J. McCarthy, quarterback of Michigan, uh, 6'3", 202 pounds, age 21, hometown LaGrange Park, Illinois. I don't know what that's at, but that's yeah. where he's from. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Illinois. <laughs> Illinois. <laughs> so, see, um, I, think, 
basically his weight his weight oh. is weird uh, two, 202 two, two, turn your two pounds yeah so that, that must have been a young age because i think i got a different weight now he's 219 oh, okay. max six okay. two is 219 so everything okay. else is correct but anyway jj had a um 119 rating 2800 uh -huh. yards 73.2 i mean these guys got some great completion rates they yes. don't Touchdowns, 22 and four interceptions. That's not bad. Not bad at all. Not bad. All right. We're going to switch off what we read. I get the next one. You get the next one. You ready? Okay. All right. Joe Alt, off of the tackle, Notre Dame, mm -hmm. 6 7, 322. Ooh. Man, he's big. He is big. Years old. <laughs> <laughs> he is big. Hometown, North Oaks, Minnesota. Oh, wow. So I ain't gonna talk much about the nine. Uh, Notre Dame had a decent run game. The guy he yeah. gave up a lot of sacks last year. So you know, hey, mm -hmm. Joe Alt's a big man. All right, definitely. Let's, yep. Let's get to the next one. We're gonna run out of time. We keep going. So try to talk about everybody. <laughs> we just gonna talk about some people. Uh -oh. Want to pronounce that one? Oh my <laughs> god! Try Om you water Fashina? Fashuno. Fashuno. Okay, I was close. Okay. <laughs> Penn yeah, State, <laughs> Penn State, uh, six six three seventeen pounds, age twenty one, hometown Wodaf, Maryland. Yeah, he's a, another another That's big guy. One. That's a big guy. Yeah, but you know what? He, they say he's the second best lineman. I think the kid from Washington's the second best lineman, but we'll talk about yeah. him later. On. Yeah, he, come, he comes up later, but yeah, another mm -hmm. old lineman. Man. This is one of those fourteen old linemen I was talking about right here. So. Oh, yeah, it's 14 old lines gonna go in, the, go in the top 50 that I have on my list. Yep, all right, all right, let's get to the next person, mm -hmm. number nine person. I think he is uh, Rome. I like him, <laughs> Rome, a dude, a dude, wide receiver, Duse. Washington. Yeah, uh, 6'3, 216, 21 years old, hometown Las Vegas. All right. <laughs> I love Las Vegas. That's my second home. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see what I do there. He had a good year last year, also. Oh yeah. He, uh, yeah, Micah Pence was the quarterback there, so he oh, yeah. he, he lit it up too. <laughs> yeah, he, he did his he did his thing. How's that? Yeah. So. Oh yeah. Okay, hold on for a second. But yeah, he's like I said, he ran a what he ran a he did a four four. Not bad. That's great speed. That's actually. not bad at all. And it's crazy. I don't know his number that was. Right. I can't find this number. But anyway, Rome Odunze, wide receiver from Washington, man. So that's Drake Murphy, uh, favorite receiver. Yeah. <laughs> Look at this big old guy coming here right now. <laughs> oh, <What's> BB. Up, <laughs> surprise, surprise. <laughs> but yeah, so. I can say he, 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 to me. What's up? Think, What's up, y'all? What's happening? Hey, hey, surprise, surprise. I think <laughs> I got something to say about him tomorrow, too. So <laughs> I, I, I think out of all the wide receivers, that's gonna, he's going to be the best one next year. Yeah. This kid right here. I agree. I think he's going to be the best wide receiver out of this class. That's just me. Yeah. So, I agree with you on that. All right. Who we got next? Mm hmm. I'm gonna let Will read this. He loves this person. Uh uh. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> you in there, big dog? I'm here. Can you hear me? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Can you read that? Read that one. Yeah, um, what's you talking about? Brock Brown tight end. Yeah. Six four two forty. Hometown, Napa, California. California. Ooh. That's my that's my that's my I like him. I know we ain't got no chance at him, so I just want him to go to the AFC. You know what? You, yeah. I want him to go to the AFC. I, if he goes to the AFC, I'll be here. Will, Listen. can I dream? Can I dream? Yes, <laughs> Will. Will. <laughs> Will. He yeah. will be there. He will be there when we pick. When but we that, wouldn't be a, that wouldn't be a smart pick, but we need yeah, that defense in. We need he that defense so. Yeah, I know. It won't be he, a smart pick. He will be there, but yeah, we, we're not going to pick him. Now the GM Pam will probably go ahead and pick yeah. you. <laughs> I wouldn't think about anybody else. G <laughs> GM Pam, GM Pam playing for that Super Bowl, <laughs> Super Bowl of Buzz, huh? And I'll probably go ahead and trade Kyle Pitts away. I hate to say that, but yeah. 
I think this cat missed like six games last year. He still had yeah. 56 receptions, 714 yards, and six touchdowns. Could have had more. That's yeah. that just that's just receiving touchdowns. I, if he, I yeah, if he didn't get if he didn't get injured, he, he Ooh, probably had way like more touchdowns. Way yeah. more. Yeah. What's going on, Bernard? Welcome in, man. Southside 12, what's going on? Welcome in, man. Yeah, welcome in, y'all. So, but yeah, let's get to that. that that's a, that's my tenth person <laughs> that I have in what's going. All right, let's get to the next one. Miss Pam, you get this next. Okay. Oh, my, my, my. Latu Latte. Age from UCLA, 6'5", 265, age 23, hometown Sacramento, California. That's my that's both of my March draft pick. <laughs> I like so, him. <laughs> Latu. Latte. Yeah. So um good edge, man. He he has it all. He he's the most complete one in there. Mm-hmm. But um I'm I'm starting to I don't know. I, I don't know about the Falcon about this pick. So you'll yeah. see tomorrow. I'll talk more about it tomorrow. So tomorrow okay. a very okay. interesting subject I got tomorrow. Yeah. So I'm doing when I do my, my final mock draft, you guys will be like, whoa, what are you looking at? But anyway, mm-hmm. I'm gonna get it done. Okay. Tell me what, what's happening, brother. All right, who's got who we got okay. next? So lot two. Next. So oh, you don't think we get lot two? I talk about tomorrow. He talk about it tomorrow. Uh, you talk about it tomorrow. I, I probably he probably convinced me of it. <laughs> I think I think that's the best one to get right now, in my opinion. He already got the toolbox. All you got to teach him is to be consistent. That's and, all you got to teach him. And, and Jimmy Lates is the coach. He used to coach him. Right. And he used to coach him, right? Yeah. Uh-huh. So I figured that. All right. Let, let, let. Carry on. We'll talk about tomorrow. Yeah, y'all see tomorrow. We'll see. We'll talk about. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. I got okay. to get something about. Stuff okay. Carry on, Arnold, <laughs> cornerback, Alabama. Six feet, one ninety six, age twenty one, hometown Tallahassee, Florida. Okay. Alabama guy though, you know. Mm-hmm. I'm, 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 I'm kind of edgy on Alabama guys. We've, mm-hmm. been, we've been screwed by everyone we had here, so yeah. Mm-hmm. Good. <laughs> yeah. All right, who we got next? We're gonna go on. Okay. Somebody take this next. Uh, Dallas Turner. Edge, Alabama, 6'4", 251 pounds, hometown, Fort Lauderdale, Florida. That's who everybody want the Falcon to draft right yeah. now. Everybody, that's all everybody's pick. They go in. They heard, they heard, they heard Nick Saban talk about him. Nick Saban yeah. talks about this. Yeah, they go for them name players. Yeah. Want none of that, bro. He's got to have piece. He got to have um, pieces around him in order to see. You know, so you got to put him in a good position. I think he he give me that wrong vibe, like he mm-hmm. self by himself though. And that 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 would be some terrible teammate right there, man. So yeah, but yeah, but that's that's yeah. that's Dallas. Yeah. Oh, oh, that's that's Dallas. Dallas. <laughs> 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 All right. Quinion Mitchell, cornerback, Toledo. Like Six feet, 196. Mm-hmm. Age 22, hometown, Winston, Florida. I don't know where the hell Winston, Florida is. Where's Winston, Florida? You drive truck. Oh. Where's that? Wait, Will. Uh, hell of a no coat. <laughs> I ain't, ha- I ain't have to deliver that. <laughs> I, bet, I bet your Night Rider would know what for. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah Night, Night Rider, boy. He probably know what for. It's about 10 miles outside of Tallahassee. That's what dogs go for. Oh. Yeah, South Side to turn on the best cover corner in the draft. Okay. He's the best one you've seen. I'm mm. just saying that. Because so. he's on TV more. You say Arnold from the Alabama? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, now. no. I say him get burnt too. I say yeah, him get burnt now. Mm-hmm. But I'm, I'm, I'm going I'm gonna, to, like I said, watch tomorrow. You got to watch tomorrow. You gotta I watch got to watch tomorrow. Yeah. about some people. <laughs> so, Go trying to hold y'all, man. He's trying to keep y'all and make y'all come tomorrow. I got some subjects to talk about tomorrow about this draft. This mm-hmm. is my this is my final mock draft. So mm-hmm. before I do mock draft, I want to put some stuff out there, put uh-huh. it in the universe. How's it put it in the universe? Let the universe 
fill in for it. Mm -hmm. All right, what we got next? Jerry Verse, Edge, F, uh, FSU, 6'4", 260 pounds, hometown, Dayton, Ohio. He's already a grown man. He's 23. Yeah. He's a grown man already. He only got one move, though, Coach. He, he a bull rusher to them. No, he, he, <laughs> he, 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 has a, he has a nice deep dip real well. He, he used his hand. He has good hands, too. He uh -huh. has good hand work, too. So. He, he pinned that corner good? Yeah, he pinned the corner. He turned that corner well. Mm -hmm. but he, gets, he gets under those arms. Yeah. But, you know, a, a skill tackle will slow him down. That's what I'm saying. Like, what 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 happened when they got to face a skill attack? Who get to the spot before you get down there? What? But the thing is, I talk about tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he said he got talking about tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Let him do his fifty draft pick right now. <laughs> I, 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 I'm not gonna do it tomorrow. That's my whole that's my whole subject matter for what I start my draft tomorrow. Well, we gotta so, tune yeah. in tomorrow to see what you he got, got to, to you say. You gotta tune in tomorrow for this one. Tomorrow yeah. gonna be yeah. It's gonna be very very detailed stuff tomorrow. So we know he's going to shake the tree. Shake the tree. Well, well it, it may shake a little something. <laughs> it, it may do a little bit. All right, who we got next? Uh, Zion Newton, guys. Zion nice Newton. Uh -oh. He's an edge tackle. He, he's some what? everything. They got him as, they got him as, I should have put DT edge because he plays outside also. Kid from Illinois. He's 6'2", 295, A21, hometown St. Pete, Florida. Wow. He went all the way up up north to play college. Wow! <laughs> yeah. I think he was on a um, a low four star top three. So I think when he, when he left, mm -hmm. yeah, but, some all, some all don't be getting those those big scholarships from the big school like that. Right, so, yeah. right, right, gotcha. right. Go out gotcha. and make a name for themselves, you know. Right. Gotcha. But um, I, I I I when I put him on here, he's in the I say he's in the top fifty. Mm -hmm. But I don't see first round no more. How's that? Mm -hmm. So, but yeah, I had him first round, but not no, not no more. Not. He said Newton is awesome. He said not not Cam, done Newton, not, huh? Oh, okay, I got what you said. Oh, you, no, you're no. almost confused with that, Noah. <laughs> <laughs> like not Cam, what? Okay, no. but yeah, I don't got him in my first round anymore. I had him in my first round early, but I think he's gonna drop to the second. I think. Okay. I think. I think. So. Okay. All right. What we got next? All right. JC Ladd. This is another one of these offensive tackles. Nice tackle. This oh. Alabama guy, 6'6, 359. He's a big cat. That's there a big is. cat. There he is big. But he's going to drop some weight when he comes to the NFL. That's, that's <laughs> big. Yeah, see, he, he couldn't even play at that size on Elm Georgia. Kirby make him get down to 340, 345. Yeah, 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 yeah. I didn't think he was, to me, I didn't think he was that, that guy. Mm. Alabama had some good offensive of linemen. He, he, he's not in that category of those ones that they had in the past to mm -hmm. me. So, mm -hmm. but he's 6'6", six, six, 359. That's a big old man. That's a big dude. Big, big, dog. Big, big. He's, he's He's still younger than all my kids, but yeah, he's a kid then. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all right, let's go to the next one. Who want that next one? <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> I got it. I got it. Talalise <laughs> Fage. Anyway, Faye. Faye. Yeah, anyway, Samoan kid, big guy, another big guy, off of the tap mm -hmm. from Oregon State. Um, 6'6, 334, age 22, hometown, Tacoma. I know this kid. I actually coached uh -huh. against this kid. Wow. So, and he was he was he been big all his life. So mm -hmm. <laughs> nice. Yeah. But yeah, you know, he's he's one of the kids that made it out, man, because the guys yeah. bigger than him, mm -hmm. who's better than him. Uh-huh. They ain't doing what he's doing. Oh this wow. Has, this kid has a chance to be a first round pick. That's good. Yeah, so. Mm -hmm. But yeah, so I like I I was trying to see can I contact his brothers. I knew his brothers. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to tell him, tell him congratulations, man. Tell him to keep his head strong, man. So exactly. So Fu Awa, uh Fu Okay. Thank you, Josh. What's going on? 
Appreciate you, man. Appreciate you. We have oh, number no, 18 no. for this is number 18 for we still got 32 to go. <laughs> right. Yeah. That's 25 minutes. So we got a good uh, time, I think. All right. Okay. Now, Ryan Thomas Jr. Ryan right. Thomas Jr. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's shoot. Want a Jaden Thompson? Yeah, he, he was good too. Now he was good. See, I'm, this that's 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 mm -hmm. my thing about. I think this guy here made what's going. He was because he's killing him downfield. He's a deep threat. Mm hmm. Yep. And he's getting double team, leaving Nables open to make all those you know, impressive plays. Exactly. So, but he's the he's the fourth best receiver going for these guys today. At least what mm -hmm. they say anyway. Wow. And he had good numbers too. He had over a thousand yards too. He had six eight mm -hmm. receptions. He had 17 touchdowns. Mm. And they both averaged about 17 yards uh per per catch. Six three two oh nine. Whoever gets him gonna be a be a happy camper too. Yep. So all right. Who we got next? All right, Big Will, you can have this one. <laughs> uh, Marion Mills, offensive tackle, Georgia, six seven three forty, age twenty one, hometown. That should be Georgia. Tackling, what? What? That should be Georgia. I don't know. They ever got a Georgia. 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 That should I be Georgia. Georgia. I don't know. I hit it. No, like, what, what the hell is DA? There's no DAs, cause it's Georgia. <laughs> that, that, hey, I, I start, mean, I start hey, going that, to my little Tassars uh, in my brain about. Uh, 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 <laughs> hey, Will. Hey, Will. I'm that's, gonna say Delaware. <laughs> no, that's that's down below Atlanta. How's that? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that should be Georgia, Cochran, Georgia, man. Hey. Yeah. he's six seven. He's another big sucker. Yes. Boy, if he can stay healthy, he'll be dangerous. He can stay healthy, he can be dangerous. Exactly. exactly. He said, Georgia. Come on, Nora. Leave me alone. He said, Georgia. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Co I, Coach I, up here creating yeah. got those stakes, man. He created stakes over here. I think I was in the dark when I did this. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I had my I don't think I had my big lights on. I think I just had my silver light on. <laughs> I missed that. G to D. That that's my twentieth uh player that I like. So okay. here's my twenty first player that I like. All right. Ooh. Oh, cool lady. That great Kool -Aid Kool -Aid. Kool -Aid. on the back, Alabama, six one, one ninety four. Age twenty one, old town, Birmingham, Alabama. All right. I, 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 I got him there because that's what the naysayers say, but I don't think he's that great of a cornerback mm. per se. I'm just looking at what the naysayers think about the draft. Mm -hmm. That's why I put him up there, but I don't think he's <sighs> that's just me, but mm -hmm. I think he's the better special team guy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he may just be used for special teams. I, I remember know. that a lot of good special team uh, yeah. players. Yeah, he we got Hellums on our team. He's, he's a so. great. He's a great returner. I, I tell yeah. you, he's a great returner. So, yeah. Uh, what's up, uh, what's up, Jarvis? Fifty-eight Gillum. What's going on? I haven't seen you in a while, man. Yeah, Southside coming at you now, coach. Yeah, yeah. I see him. <laughs> <laughs> that's like hey, that's like Dakla, Georgia. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what the Dakula? The cooler. The cooler. <laughs> I thought Georgia. it was Dracula. Yeah. <laughs> it's the yeah. cooler. It's the cooler. Yeah. It's the cooler. Hold on. Right. Oh, not not it's Dracula. Right now, not it's like not Dracula, Auntie Pam. Dracula, Georgia. Yeah. Yep. I was like, man. <laughs> so, yeah, just so like oh, uh, Willa Coochie so Georgia. Georgia. Willa Coochie yeah, Georgia. Georgia. That's right. Don't, you, don't get caught in Willa Coochie Georgia at night. Just like Kasumi, Florida. It's I thought it was kissing me. <laughs> kissing me. Yeah, kissing me. It's Kasumi. <laughs> Jerry said he's been working. I'm glad to have you in here, brother. Yep. All right. Next one. Now, this cat right here. Okay. Second best lineman in coming out this year. Mm-hmm. I think he's the second best lineman coming out. Yep. 
So he's six four three seventeen. Good footwork. Mm-hmm. Eight twenty three. Hometown in the season. Nice. Nevada. Mm-hmm. And yeah, so that's another good person right there. Mm-hmm. All right, who we got next? My boy. Uh. But he's gonna fall. He may fall out the first round though. Ooh. He may fight the first round, guys. Uh-oh. He yeah. may. He chop. may. Chop, chop, chop. 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 So, Chop Robinson, Edge, Penn State, 6'3", 254. Hey, we're still trying to figure out what our last Penn State dude is going to do. I don't know about the Penn State. Dude. We got two of them. Yeah, we got that two one, of them. That's what I'm saying. We're still trying to figure out what they're going to do. Well, yeah. one was hurt last year. I, I, I'm going to talk about some of that tomorrow, too. Yeah, yeah, he's he, he going to talk about that tomorrow. Well, actually, probably not. Yeah, maybe. We'll see. <laughs> Hold on. Who the other Penn State dude we got? You got um, Honor Advocate, and you also got uh, your boy, uh, Okie Deji. Okie Deji from uh, Notre Dame. Oh, Dame. Not even Notre Dame. Okay. Yeah. You got one? That right here is from Notre Dame. Who else from Penn State? Uh, okay, yeah, he's he, from Notre he Dame. He did have somebody on there that used to play with him, but I think he got cut. Um, I don't know his name. It was two Penn State guys on the team. I mm-hmm. do remember that. But anyway, yeah. Oak Davis is from Notre Dame. Yeah, he may get cut in. <laughs> if he going to get cut, he's from Notre Dame, man, though. No. <laughs> yeah, he, he may get cut. <laughs> <laughs> anybody, anybody who played with the cat at the cat Street school, yeah, they get cut. Yeah. Prince Shibbo. <laughs> <Let me stop. laughs> He's no name, ain't he? Yeah, he no name. Hey, no one oh, man. one thing about some... it, though, they going to give him every opportunity, though, Coach. They yeah. going to give him every opportunity. Yeah. But the only thing hey, about hey, this, hey, this regime been drafted, so. Mm. Yeah. So he's going to have to show his ass off. He got to show his little, ass off. He better show more than his ass. Mm-hmm. Better show, make sure that shoulder fix. Exactly. But they say he's been playing that show to him for two years since he's been there. Mm. He finally got it worked on last year because it was, oh, wow. was unbearable. So we'll see. All right. Nate Wiggins, cornerback, Clemson, 6'2, 185. Young man from the ATL. Mm-hmm. So he's another Atlanta, Georgia kid. Yeah. But he came from Clemson. Uh. <laughs> Could we have two clips and quarterbacks? I don't see it. I don't see it. I don't see it. But you never know. Stay tuned. <laughs> How many interceptions he has? That's the question. Depend on the interception. It is. He good. He good at that. He might be here. Hold on, hold on, hold on, Miss Pam. Don't, 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 don't run out on Nate now. Don't I'm not, I'm not run out yet. I just want to know how many. See, they got all these different sizes and weight to these kids. Yeah. Man, they be tripping. <laughs> different public, different public. Well, that's the update weight. I got the up to date weight. So what he had at the oh, south side, he said he's the second best cover. That's so what they say. that's what they say. Uh, I didn't want to know how many tick. But he was, hey, he was pretty fast. He ran a four two eight. That ain't slow. No. He's projected the first round pick, though. Well, so he ran a what, coach? A 4-2-8. 4-2-8. Good gracious. That's what I said. That boy got lightning. <laughs> hey, but, that boy hey, was flying. Listen, was. we had a guy that ran a 4 2 8 before. He couldn't tackle. He couldn't cover with water. He right. He was, hold, he was holding a lot. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> we got <to> that. <laughs> he, he has good height, though. He has good oh, yeah. height. Oh, yeah. So, what's the interception of the match? I can't find it. All right. Oh, and somebody said, can he tackle? <laughs> That's the thing right there. You run fast and you hit, though. Yeah, but tackle. I know I know my boy Kabar and Lassiter can tackle. They, they sleeping on Kabar. Yeah. That, that boy come down and hits you like a lineup. Mm-hmm. He ain't going to hit nobody. No, he had he had two interceptions, one sack. Uh, okay. All right. <laughs> he had a he had a pick six though. Mm-hmm. 
he had tw- 22 solo tackles, so that's not bad for college. Okay. All right. So he's not. But then again, you got to think about Clemson plays that zone. They, they, they're known to knock balls out the air. Mm-hmm. And we see that already. Yeah. But this dude here, he's thin. He put on, but he, he did put on like 12 pounds for the combine, though. But he's a thin yeah. man. Or there the hit, yeah. He's gonna have to gain some weight. <laughs> yeah. But he, he turned that interception, one of those interceptions at 52 yards, though. So he, he can get up and go. He gets okay. It. So what's going on, Terry Lawrence? Welcome in, man. Appreciate you. All right, let's get on, man. We, we moving slow. <laughs> we on number 24. We still got 26 to go. Oh, yeah. All right. Oh, Jackson Powell. J- Jackson Powell. Jackson. That ain't his name. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> I put Jackson two times. Uh uh-uh. uh. But, but it does start with a, a J. What the hell? Happened there? All right, hey, I think, I think, <laughs> I think this coach was whispering in your ear when you wrote that down. <laughs> his name is, his last name is Johnson. Johnson, I, okay. I was thinking Michael Jackson. I don't know, but his his last name is Johnson. Yeah, y'all just no one don't you say that. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna say so? <laughs> but anyway, Jackson Power Johnson, center from Oregon, man. He's six three, three twenty. Oh the yeah, they've been talking about him. He's yeah. the best center in this draft. He's the best center in the draft. And he's yeah, he, somewhere. He's a he looks good at the senior bowl too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think I think J is a JPJ. That should have been easy. Why did I put mm-hmm. Jackson Power Jackson? What the hell did I think? <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> hey, he ran so a five. Point. He ran a five flat too. All right. Look at oh, okay, guy. he can move. He can move them hips a little bit. Yeah, mm-hmm. he can move a little bit. What, what's his? What's his? What's called time in the? In the uh, what a ten? What a ten split? His ten is. Let's see, I got to wrap this up. All right. Uh, what's that? I'm trying to find it. I don't see it. I don't see his 10th school. I don't see it up there. So, same with this. But he has a 32 inch vertical. That's not bad. Not bad at all. So, yeah, he, he, he's a he's a projected first round. For mm-hmm. sure. Mm hmm. All right, what we got next? Let's get some next one. Keon Coleman, why was he the fourth oh, state? Okay. Not a first rounder, but he's the second rounder. He's the second rounder. Could he could go later? I'm just going through what's going. Mm-hmm. He from Apollosa, Apollosa, Louisiana. I don't know what the hell that name is or mm-hmm. what that. At. <laughs> it's in between Baton Rouge and. Um... You know where is that? That's where uh, I think so. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in. It's in Louisiana. That's it's I'm in saying. Louisiana, though. <laughs> but he's six four, two sixteen. He's a young cat. He's twenty years old. I think he's coming out early, though. That's that's his thing. Yeah. And he he's one of those guys you want down in that uh, red zone. So. All right. Mm-hmm. He's. See, look at Dray Murphy. He's never you you must start it was 420 because like the sun said, I was high and I must have been high. <laughs> no nah, man, I ain't high. I don't, I don't know how to feel to be high. I'm how I'm, I'm high on life. I'm happy all the time. I, I think that, that's a, that stuff makes me sick. <laughs> hey, the coach, uh, coach was high, all right? It had a white blowing in his heel now. That won't go. No. <laughs> he was at work when I was doing that. <laughs> unless, she that and unless she blew 15 miles away, boy. <laughs> All right, let's get to the next one. <laughs> All right, let's go to the next one. Y'all crazy. Now, Will Murphy. this cat right here, Byron Murphy, the second to be exact. Mm-hmm. D tackle six one three zero eight age twenty one hometown Desoto Texas. Yeah, this is tomorrow about this cat right here. I gotta talk about this cat here tomorrow. Mm-hmm. So this is a subject that we need to listen to tomorrow. So 
Don't count this guy in the first round. A lot of people say second round. Don't count him out in the first round, guys. They in the first round. Mm-hmm. He's over Nate Noodle right now. Mm-hmm. Well, they show right. Brady to replace me. Why die? It could be. It could be. He is considered the best interior pass rusher this year. Nice. He's the best interior pass rusher. He built Ted like built Ted yeah. like Brady Terry. Yeah, exactly. Mm-hmm. Hey, but he hey he, he has violent hands, bro. Mm-hmm. This is that for violent hands. Oh yeah. So, I, I I like him. I like him over sweat. Yeah, I love him over sweat. Sports mm-hmm. sweat benefit because of him. Oh you know, yeah. All right. Wide receiver. Another wide receiver, guys. Yeah. It may be ten. What I said, ten, ten wide receivers going going this top fifty. I think I yeah, you said ten. You said ten. How you pronounce the name? Is it Dunne? Oh. I just thought it was a Dunnis. It ain't a Dunnis. I thought it was a Dunnis. A Dunnis. A Dunnis. called a Dunnis Mitchell. A Dunnis Mitchell. That's okay. A Dunnis Mitchell. Mitchell. A okay. Dunnis Mitchell. Yeah. Wide receiver, Texas, six four, one thirty six, age twenty one, hometown, Missouri City, Texas. Now, if you like George from Pittsburgh, you're gonna love a Dunne. Mm-hmm. So well, he always came up big for Georgia. Exactly. Mm-hmm. exactly. Mm-hmm. Yeah. He, he is legit. He got a he got he got him a he got him a national championship and ran. Mm-hmm. He almost got two. Yeah. Well, he 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 had went to go be close to family. Well, he's dead. That's still called. Yeah, right. he had a child. Yeah, I think he had a child on Wilson. Right he had mm-hmm. a child already. He just wanted yeah. to be there. Before. Right. I ain't yeah. mad at him. Not mad. Not mad. Gotta do what you gotta do. He helped us out in that first one. So that, that's all that matters. We good. Mm-hmm. But he, he got some piece of speed, too. He, I think he ran like a four something, also. Wow. He, ran. he ran a four. Yeah, he ran all. Uh, he was blazing. He had he like a four four two, right? He ran a real fast forty. All right. He ran a four three four. That's mm-hmm. fast. That is fast. Yeah, both both of them Texas wide receivers were running running fast out there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, he ain't considered no Texas wide. He a Georgia wide receiver. He only Texas for one year. That's the Georgia wide receiver. 55, 55 receptions, 845, 11 touchdowns, uh, 15.4 yards average. That means that they were throwing the ball a lot down there. Then. Oh, yeah. Yep. Yeah. All right. Who we got next? Yeah, Sarkeesian and took that Atlanta Falcon offense down there. That's the same mm-hmm. offense. Yeah. He, he, he was a scapegoat. He, he, was, he was. He was. Yeah. A and Quinn, you, he, he scapegoated a couple coaches. Mm-hmm. A lot of coaches. Not a couple. Yeah. Every year he was scapegoated with something. Yeah. Right. All right. Another OT. Tyler Gutton. Mm-hmm. Gatton. Gatton, whatever we call Off the tackle from uh, Oklahoma. What's up, these six, seven kids, man? My God. <laughs> what are they feeding them? Juice? Hey, the thing about them boys that big, I hope they working on injury prevention. Yeah. Putting making they making they leg uh they ligament I uh, got done. No, they ligaments stronger. Protect them joint. Yeah. In the pro these big schools, I think they do more better work with these guys than these small school guys. The thing about look at the guys who went to these big schools. A lot of those guys don't get hurt. Mm-hmm. Especially OT, I mean, off the linemen. It's the guys that come to these small schools that are playing these old linemen. A lot of those guys get hurt fast, mm-hmm. real fast. Yeah. So he's from what, Minor, Texas? Minor, Texas, yeah. It's somewhere in Texas. <laughs> <laughs> but I know a lot of Texas kids go to Oklahoma, a whole bunch of them. A whole bunch of them. They're only next door, so yeah, I have to see why. Yeah. All right. The 30th player. This is my 30th player right here. Okay. Another old lineman. Oh. Graham Barton, Duke. 6'5", 313, 821. Oh, we got a Duke boy in the we building. Got, yep, Duke. 
Yeah. Brentwood, Tennessee. I mean, he, that's another big country right there. Mm-hmm. Oh, I want to tell y'all something. I got a co-worker. His cousin, well, actually his nephew, plays with the Falcons. Who, who is that? He's from Washington. Mm-hmm. Who's on the team for Washington? Um... Big country. Oh, McGarry? Yeah. yeah. What? His uncle drives bus with me. What? So, wow. Yeah. <laughs> but him and him and the mom are distant. I said, dude, you better you better get in touch. You better be you better go apologize to that mom. <laughs> so whatever the hell happened. So I said, I need I need an exclusive. <laughs> he said, man, she don't want to talk to us. Well, <laughs> no, that's on y'all. Anyway, <laughs> Graham Bond, old lineman, Duke. I think he's a guard. I think maybe even a center. I think he's a guard, though. I just put old lineman because he's not a tackle. So, another big guy. And Duke had, who was Duke quarterback? I don't know who the other um... quarterback was. I have no idea. All right, here's my next guy. Maybe first round. People yeah, talk him up a lot. A lot Maybe first him. round. You know, it it it'd be it look good for the naysayer <laughs> to have this little guy right here. Another Jason Seahorn draft in the first round. It'd make you know people like, oh, we got a white guy draft who played DB in the first round. So. He's a first round, early second round person. He's a DB. He can play safety and he can play uh, cornerback. Uh, white cola, white cola. <laughs> yeah, he can play it, man. He, he the kid's actually it. pretty decent at it. He's, he's. I, I ain't gonna knock him. He's actually pretty good coverage. But yeah, he can ball. I, 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 you what? I would have that defense though, bro. Mm-hmm. I'll be having that defense. Especially on the edges, they have some good edges, man. Yeah, they just they just couldn't score. Yeah, they couldn't score, man. If they had some kind of outfit, they would they would have been all right. Yeah. See, John Kelly, he don't want nobody to do unless they play basketball. No, come on, <laughs> <laughs> it's an old lineman, man. <laughs> yeah, he's an old lineman. Yeah, old lineman just need to have good technique. And be That's a little it. strong. They ain't got to run fast. They just got to have some good footwork, good technique, and have a little strength. A lot of them can make it, but you got to have that heart, though. You got to have heart. Oh, yeah. All right. Let's go to number 32 first. We, we on time. We doing okay. Oh, yeah. We're doing another good. O, another old lineman, man. Maybe in the first round or second round for sure. Jordan Morgan, offensive tackle for Arizona, 6'5", 325, age 22, for Moreno, Moreno, Arizona. So, another big guy. Like I said, 14, 14 old linemen, man, mm. that's going to go in the first 50. But wow. he's another one. He's another one. Mm. I know y'all probably haven't called some of you guys favorite players, so... We got time then. Let me know who I haven't called that you think I should have called. Mm-hmm. So I know I left some people off. Like I, Lad I he, he on that list. He gotta be on I that list. I don't know about that. Oh, okay. <laughs> Troy Franklin, one of my favorite wide receivers. Okay. Oregon, six three, one eighty seven, twenty one mm-hmm. years old, hometown East Palo Alto. California. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. He's in gangster territory. No, he on the east side, though. Mm-hmm. But yeah, he's a good wide receiver, man. He had good numbers at Oregon last year, too. Getting thrown to by Bo Nix. So, if Bo Nix throwing the ball well, that means Bo Nix doing some doing some okay there. Mm-hmm. I think they got him ranked like probably the fifth or sixth best wide receiver in this class. He had a 81 receptions for 1,300 yards 
and 14 touchdowns last year. So, you know, how fast, I don't know how fast he ran. Let's see how fast he ran. I don't think he ran super fast. 4 4 1, not slow. Almost faster than me when I was younger. <laughs> you you uh, ran a 4 4 go? Hell no. <laughs> <laughs> If I had a skateboard, I could. I, yeah, I ran a four five when I was playing. Four five. <laughs> I probably can't get you. I probably get you a. Uh, I can get you a five flat right now, folks. <laughs> okay, cat. Okay, cat. We. Okay, cat. Do your thing. I'm gonna let you go run. Without without working out of that, I can get you a five flat right now. In that truck, I bet you can. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, gonna go, I'm gonna go faster than that in the truck now. Okay, all right, all right. I'm 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 I'm, I'm gonna let you. I'm gonna let you. I, I believe you. You don't hurt yourself though. <laughs> <laughs> I believe you can do it. Okay, I believe everybody say you can do it. If you say you can yeah. do it, you can do it. Uh -huh. But don't hurt yourself. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go. Another offensive line. Ooh. Yeah. UConn. A, he's swole, man. He's, too swole. See, he's, too, he's a little short, though. See, this is funny about this kid right here, man. His age ain't nowhere. Wow. His name is Christian Hayes. No, they don't know how old he is. Yeah, man. I think this dude probably 30. He looks old too, bro. <laughs> Y'all, I think he's old, man. He got his age is nowhere. But he I think he'll be a top 50 pick. Yeah. So he may be like 25, 26 already. He's old. Wow. I don't know. He looks old. Mm. I think I think he's I think he's from uh one of the African countries. Mm -hmm. I think he looks like he's from one of the African countries where I look yeah. at his face, but I could be wrong, but his age is not listed nowhere. I I check mm -hmm. all kind of media. No age. Hmm. He may be thirty already. <laughs> mm -hmm. See that that's why I have no age because it's not. I can't find it nowhere. Can't find it nowhere. Nowhere. I look. I don't, they ain't got no birthday. <laughs> I think they got. I think they got the day in the year. I mean the day in the, the day in the month, <laughs> but no year. It probably said 1965. <laughs> wow, he he's up there. <laughs> that's part, hey, that's Paul. That's probably that's probably yeah. He yep. old though. All right, let's go to the next. <laughs> <laughs> oh, who was that guy right there? There you go. He yeah. Is. Oh yeah. Yeah, he's six. He's six. Yeah. One eighty five. Twenty two. Chat work. Chat work, that's an old country boy out. Country, yeah, country boy, country mm -hmm. boy. Yeah. So yeah, he, he may he may squeeze at the end of the first round. May. Hey, you know, you know he country when his favorite team was Tennessee. He's mm -hmm. country country. That might be Ooh. North. He might be from North. Chat work might be North Georgia. Then. <laughs> yeah. That'd be North Georgia. Be like Tennessee. He must be on the border or some stuff. But then his family go to uh went to Tennessee. That's why he liked the Tennessee because his family was, was in Tennessee. I uh, went to Tennessee. Oh no, I know he was. They all uh, told him he wasn't good enough. Ooh. But that, uh, that's why. That's why every time he played against Tennessee, he, he went crazy on. Him. Mm -hmm. Went crazy on. Him. <laughs> mm -hmm. They told him he too long. He wasn't good enough. Uh, what? I said that's a them problem. <laughs> exactly. Kirby Kirk Smart said, "Give him to him. I know what to do with him. I know what." To do. Will make him a household name. Yeah, Kirk Spawn made that man a beast. All right, let's get to the next one. Yeah, it's near Tennessee. That 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 part. Number thirty-six player, another old lineman. Six six three twenty-four. What the heck did I put in there? He's he's twenty-four years old. I know he's <laughs> I don't know what the hell I was doing right there. Boy, I, I had a night that day now. <laughs> He's from Orem, Utah. Damn. He's 324 years old. He good. No, no, <laughs> <the town. laughs> He's he, 24. He, he, he look good I'm, for I'm, an A, Coke. He I'm, look I'm good for sure. an A. <laughs> I'm going to make sure. 
don't know. That was a that day, boy. I was doing some stuff. That's that a day. Yale player right there. That joke's like, oh. Yeah. Yeah, he's from Yale, man. Mm-hmm. Yale, yeah. hey, Yale produced your boy. Was the leading tackle the last two years in football. Yeah, so yeah, he's smart. He might have then uh, made some uh, another Asia green or something, you know. Yeah. He's some more than that joke. Oh yeah. yeah. He's a poly. Yeah, he's uh let me tell all this cat. I got his baby right here. He's 21. What the hell I get 324 <laughs> for? Oh, his birthday the same day as my wife's birthday. Oh. I just I, I didn't know that. It's him. Nope, don't want him on the team, then. <laughs> Damn, he's three hundred twenty four. Come on, Sasa. I leave me alone, man. <laughs> You know, they don't waste no time in the chat, though. They don't waste no time. <laughs> Listen, I was trying to get these things in, man. I, was, I tried to do it. I noticed it was late, and I, I think it was like late when I was doing the too. <laughs> I went to bed late that night trying to get them all done because I was, didn't want to do it the next day. Yeah. All right. Darius Robinson. Yep. Missouri. I like this kid. Me too. See, this cat, no. He can be tricky. Mm-hmm. He can be a first rounder. But for sure, second rounder. Because mm-hmm. somebody would take a if all those guys, are, for instance, us talk more about the If we trade back late, mm-hmm. late, I mean like past 20, 22, mm-hmm. 23, mm-hmm. I can see us popping on this cat. Mm-hmm. I can see us jumping on and getting this kid. Mm-hmm. So, but if not, We'll see. Like I, I got to talk about something about that. Those picks tomorrow. Yeah. Man, so. Be a good one. <laughs> All right. That's number thirty-seven. Man, we got. I still got some more people. Oh. Thirty-seven. So, oh. so him, him or Ellis, little brother, coach. Which one? <sighs> see, I don't have. I don't think I have Ellis in my top group. I don't think Ellis. Not in my top fifty. See, if I can. That first third round pick, if I haven't got an in, haven't got an edge, then I look at Ellis. Mm-hmm. Like I said, when I got these right here, I'm just looking at the top 50 that I think the people will pick. Yeah. But as far as Falcons, if it came down to him or or what's going, I think he's going to go before Ellis, almost for sure. Mm-hmm. But if he's gone and Ellis, I'm talking about I'm talking about your choice, your choice. My choice. Take it? Yeah, Ellis, little brother. Yeah, this Ellis. kid right here, this kid right here. Like Don't this. take him. Yeah, I, like I would take him. I would take him. If it came down to those two, I think I would take Darius. Mm-hmm. He's a much better. He's better against the run, and he he got a great. He's a good passer. But the only thing about him, reason I don't think they would take him. He's the same as the kid we got last year. That's the same. You see what I'm saying? Tell us that, Harris. Yeah, he, that's, that's, that's the same. That's the same. Yeah. Same weight, same, almost same size, almost the same. Everything. Yeah. So, unless yeah. we're just trying to solidify, make sure nobody don't, you know, escape the edge and we're just going to seal everything in, force everything inside. Yeah, I would draft mm-hmm. those guys. And we go into a traditional, traditional four three. Yeah, mm-hmm. he'd be great. But they talk about three four. He, we already got that guy for what's going. On. They can, they can rotate. Yes, but I, I don't see him going mm-hmm. that early for. Then again, you never know. I like Darius, so I do like Darius. Yeah. But then again, they they may double team and stack up and get two edge guys. We don't know. Yeah, we don't know. If we could be a fly on that wall in yeah, that draft that, room, that draft room would be crazy. Mm-hmm. That's gonna be some serious. All right, oh, here's boy. my other quarterback. Mm-hmm. Bo Nix, quarterback of Oregon, six six two two fourteen, old, twenty four years old. I thought he was older, but he's only twenty four. Not bad. Mm-hmm. He's from Bo Nix. He's from <laughs> what the hell, Arky. Okay. Arkadefia, Arkad, Arkadefia, Arkansas. Arkansas. I think that is that right. Arkansas, AK. 
Yeah, oh, AK, yeah, AK, AK, Arkansas. Yeah, Arkansas. AL is Alaska. Okay. Mm-hmm. okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I said, did I screw up again? Arkansas, What the hell kind of town is that? Oh, that's why he put. Is he the same guy? No, that's that's other guy who put the, put the uh, mayonnaise in his coffee. That, okay, that's not there. Now that's the one play for Tennessee. Tennessee, yeah, okay. <laughs> About the same thing. They both country here. Yeah. But yeah, Bo Nix, man. He's gonna get drafted. And don't be shocked if you see him go first round. Don't be shocked. Hey, I think he had to get out of the Auburn because that was yeah. uh that was yeah. not a good situation for him. No, he good. Like I say, he good against everybody but Georgia. <laughs> he can play. Georgia, Georgia, he always look like garbage. He can Ooh. play against everybody else. He good. <laughs> but yeah. It, it, it wouldn't shock me. He's a first round pick. It wouldn't. It wow. Wouldn't. Well, yeah, you already got a couple teams talking about it right now, Coach. But yeah, yeah it, it's gonna be hard though. I, uh, I don't know, but we'll see. <laughs> he's my thirty eight. He's my thirty eighth person. Okay. Now, this next one here, the speed okay. demon. Texas. Yeah. He can speak to me. I'm just yep. saying. Now they they get. They got him marked first round. Mm. I don't see it. I, 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 I know he's fast. The only reason he made marked in the first round because he ran that four two. He ran that four two. So that's the only reason he in the first round. So he was in that. He was in that group with Lad McCunky though. He was in that yeah. same group. Mm-hmm. This is his numbers last year. Hmm. Seventy five reception, which is a lot. 1,014 yards, five touchdowns. He mm-hmm. averaged 13.5 uh, yards per reception. Mm-hmm. So the kid is fast. 0-2-1. That's mm-hmm. lightning. Yeah. That's lightning, lightning. See, this is the funny thing. They got these heights. That height he got there, and what I see on different publications, he got two different heights. Mm-hmm. He's five. He, they say 6'1", 172. Mm-hmm. I say he's no taller than six feet. Yeah. And he must put on his weight yesterday. Because I got him like, I thought he was real skinny. I thought he was like 165, 170. Well, one, that's probably right. But he is fast. Yep. But he got baby hands. <laughs> <laughs> but he run, his 10 yard split, you know what his 10 yard split was, Big Will? One yeah, what was? 1.4. What? If you don't put your hands on that sucker, you just mm-hmm. got me. Mm-hmm. He's going to burn your drones off. Yeah. Oh. yeah. See, I'm, I'm, I'm interested to see if he's going to race Tyreek. He may eat Tyreek alive. <laughs> yeah, that's why That's why you need uh, last of them. Jam the receiver at that line. He don't let him get that get off. This kid can jump too. This dude got a 41 inch vertical. What the hell? Ooh. Oh, wow. His broad jump is 131. So that's 131 divided by 12. That's all. Well, you know, the, the fast people, the fast people usually can jump. But you know, all that power comes from the quad. He, he got some points. 131, 131 inches, bro. Wow. That's 12 feet and some change. What the hell? He's very young, 20. He's, he's, he's young. a baby. Yeah, he's a baby. Oh. His, birthday is, his birthday is the 27th of this month. That means he'd be oh, 21 then. 21. Okay. He'd be 21 when season start. Okay. <laughs> his birthday's coming up real soon. Wow. But his hands are little. He got eight, eight inches and three four. I guess it's okay for a while to Mm-hmm. That means he just gotta have some extra sticky gloves. That's yeah, it. Yeah, I have some super gloves. Yeah. <laughs> and NFL football is a little bit bigger than the college football. People, hey man, the glove, the glove they make these days, coach. You yeah. don't got to do never get a, a finger on that dog on yeah. ball. He gonna get it. You just hope he don't get hit. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> now, one of the, the hardest hitting yep. safeties, hardest hitting safety in college yeah. right here. Yep. I mean, I'm sorry, cornerbacks. Cornerback. Yep. TJ Tampa from Iowa State. Mm-hmm. He would knock your block off. Oh yeah. Off your head. Mm-hmm. Cover skills okay. But you want that guy 
Ooh. Ooh, wait. You gonna hit somebody? He gonna hit you. <laughs> but he actually he's a second round pick. So you looking at him as a safety then? No, he's a quarterback. He's, 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 a, he's, he's, he's a corner. He's a, he covers well, but he he's not my kind of corner. He he's a good uh zone cover, zone corner. Mm -hmm. He'd be good in the corner. What is, what yeah. Zone, what is zone zone guy? I can't even talk to him. Let's see what nice. He's, well, it's temporary. He's in his own way. He ran a four four five. Not bad. He had two interceptions. Mm -hmm. uh, he had seven pass deflects, forty four mm -hmm. tackles, thirty three of them solo. Mm -hmm. He's a. Oh so, yeah. I get that one. Hey, Cole. Yes, sir. Have you noticed we always give excuses for quarterback? I don't give. He's a good. He's a good zone caller. Yeah, you know, he'll play prep. But if we say something crazy like that, like for a quarterback, we'll be lighting that quarterback up right now. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, he only he only can throw slant. Oh, you'll be lighting him up all day. A lot of them can't mm -hmm. throw slant. That's the problem. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> but yeah, you probably. If, if we wanted a cornerback, I think he'd fit our scheme. Mm -hmm. I think he'd our scheme. Yeah. He's pretty good at press man. So, zone. He's oh, so, so, you think we're going to play a lot of zone this year? Of course. We're going to be special. Probably a lot of one, a lot of man, too. So we, we need somebody who can you know, do a lot of blitz. We're going to see our cornerbacks blitzing a lot. A lot. A lot, lot, lot. Probably too much for me sometimes. Yeah. But he's from. I, well, I was screwed up this whole thing. Him, boy, I got this man coming. From, <laughs> he's from Florida. Oh, he's from Florida. Yeah, he's oh. from St. Pete. Oh. What the hell I was looking at? Hmm. Let me see what I got. I got him right here. What the hell? I got North Sound PA. Anyway. All right. Uh, yeah. Penn State guy. Uh, this is another A guy. That's, that's the one. <laughs> yeah. He, He's a he's a uh, he reminds me not of Parson, uh huh, but he can do a lot of things Parson can do. I think. Oh yeah, he's in the middle, pretty good on the edge. He sets the run. He run. He's a better run defender than Chop. I think. Yeah. Me. But yeah, he's a lot of Penn State guy. Six four, two forty nine. Mm -hmm. So. He is what he is. He's to be a second round pick. He's in like he's a top fifty player, I think, that I have mm -hmm. here. Yeah. So, but I agree. You never know if if those edge start going, the people that they need the edge, mm -hmm. you may see some stuff. Oh yeah. So, but I see him a second round. Where yeah, if they go, if they go on a run again this year, they go. Yeah, yep. So. Yep. But yeah. But I, I heard so who who is that? They talk about uh, you may see verse going to Jacksonville. What? I've seen nah, that would be a stupid pick if Jacksonville pick him up. That would be the oh, dumbest pick ever. Why would it? They just they just paid the other edge rusher, and they got a young rusher in Walker, so they had a third rusher. You can, you, you that, can never that have no sense. Listen, you can never have too many rushers. But you know, some, at some point, somebody gonna want both playing time. Though. Now, well, you know, you got you two superstars if, already now. But think about it; he could just be a situational guy. Hmm. Oh well, he's not even. He, is he a top pick right now? No, he's not. He, he's second round guy. Second okay, round. well, yeah, you can you can work. You can roll. You can roll. But I'm, I'm talking. About, I'm talking about Jack Burst though. Huh? I'm talking about Burst in general. Yeah, Burst, Burst is not finna work in that situation. So he gonna be crying. He look like the type of player that gonna cry. He already he, set out. He set out. He set out because they didn't make it to the playoffs. He set out because they didn't make it to the playoffs, Coach. Well, that's, that's my South Carolina guy. <laughs> <laughs> now, here's, and then, and this oh, they go that, that country yeah. motherfucker. Yeah. 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 But you know what, though? He's a hell of a receiver. Yes, he is. And <laughs> I, I've been watching tape on South Carolina games. Oh, yeah. Y'all know good. something? I'm going to tell you something. He's good. Spencer, Spencer Rattler is not a bad quarterback. He's not. I tell. I keep telling y'all that. 
Well, yeah, I yeah. forgot he played at uh, Oklahoma. Now he yeah. he played behind he, a good dude who not a trained quarterback. But, yeah, so. that's that's the thing. He played quarterback, and he when Caleb Williams got there, he's like, oh y'all gonna saw him? I'm gone. Mm -hmm. If Caleb Williams never went to Oklahoma, what's called the state of Oklahoma? He probably would have won a Heisman. Probably so. I'm just yeah, every everybody wearing a Heisman up there. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but it. <laughs> That's a damn shame, man. Yeah. <laughs> right. Every quarterback they hit coast on that one eye. Yeah. yeah don't, don't sleep on Spencer, man. Yeah, yeah, don't sleep on Spencer. I keep telling y'all. So, but yeah, this guy's 6'3, 227, and he's country. <laughs> he's from Mother, South Carolina. I don't know what Mother hey, is. And we ain't we ain't yes, playing when we say he country. Go check out his clip. That oh, boy country, boy. <laughs> but yeah, man. I, I hope he, he can. First round, I think he has first round talent for sure. Wow. I think he has first round talent. So but I don't I don't see him going the first round. That that depends on how well he blocks, though. How good a blocker he is. Well, um. Shit, some of those guys don't know who who's in that top guy, they ain't no good blocker. They just can catch. How good is Word? He ain't no good blocker, he just fast. Mm -hmm. So it, I don't know how they draft these guys these days. Yeah. I wouldn't mind seeing him in our watch card. We give him the second round at 43. I wouldn't mind. I would. Mm -hmm. But our first round pick got to hit. So Definitely got hit. He has to hit. Definitely. So, not trust Terry. So that, that's oh, I do. They The scouting team have done an excellent job, you know, right, in setting him up for the last few years. So, we yeah. We, we, got, we still got eight more people to go. All right, here's the next one. <laughs> Oh, the best passing quarterback, the best passing quarterback in yeah. this draft. Uh oh, Michael Pennis. He's a lefty. They go, y'all, Mike Vick, y'all. He's a lefty. <laughs> 23 years old. He's in hometown, Tampa, Florida. How you going? Oh, yeah, yeah. See, <laughs> see, yeah, the foul, you tell him he's going to be close to home. <laughs> hey, he's a lefty. Yeah. Now, like I say, he 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 he's he can be a first round pick, maybe, maybe, but I see second on him. Yeah. But guys, don't sleep on the on this team here I don't know why. He's got a good arm. He has a but his, his deep ball does for me and Mike look at his deep ball floats it, a little bit too much for me. His toughness, his toughness is what I'm worried about a little bit. How he, tough he's tough. be. What do you mean? He is tough. Hey, Michigan tapped him up a little bit. He folded now. He folded like a little bit. Let me hit you in your rib. <laughs> it's he's going to hit that. I said that before he got hit, his line can block. They, that, that go for all these kids trying to have all they got doing 4% body fat. That, that what happened when you have 4% body fat. He, you ain't got nothing protecting them. He needs a fat. Yeah. He <laughs> needs to put some fat. That wasn't fat for fat. It's protect. You need to be like around by sixteen percent body oh. fat. That's good enough. That's good, right now. It was side side twelve. He's basically a black guy. <laughs> <that hurt. laughs> Technically, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Technically, yeah, to a degree. They yeah. had a private workout with him, so yeah, I'm curious. So it's it's something there. Mm -hmm. All right, let's go to the next one here. We're almost done. <laughs> Zach Fraser. Oh, old lineman from uh, he's a center, I think, from West Virginia. I think he could have been. I don't know why he's not higher, but I think because he's a center. Nobody's really looking for centers and guard mm -hmm. type people. But he he probably be one of your first old lineman type person go off the board besides a tackle who's not a mm -hmm. tackle. Mm -hmm. Exact. So West Virginia, six three three, eleven twenty two years old, Fairmont, West Virginia. Mm -hmm. That means he had to deal with that damn mansion guy. Oh, poor guy. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, so. <laughs> but he went. He didn't know that. It's just a different guy. Okay, I think, so. I think he ran a five flat. I think I should have put the speed down the two by the Yeah. All right, next guy. Well, we ain't got a couple more minutes after that. Mm -hmm. It's uh Patrick Paul off of the tackle from Houston. Yeah. Six seven, 315, 23, hometown Houston Tech. Six seven linemen. Man, these guys are big. Mm -hmm. But he's a second round pick, man. Like I said, 14 old linemen, I think, can go in this first 
this first mm -hmm. fifty picks. Mm -hmm. So, and I'm gonna keep my list. If, if they mark out, I'm gonna mark them out. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna see how many I really see. That's see how many you got right, Coach. Yeah, right. You got yeah. right. <laughs> like I said, these ain't these ain't in order where they're going. I, mm -hmm. I just got them up here, so. Only oh, they be in the top 50, you know? Yeah, they top 50. The top 50, yeah. See how I work this out. See that I do it okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Who's my next guy? Mm -hmm. Uh-oh. I'm going to let Will do this one. Oh. Oh, we got Kamari Lassiter. Defensive back, Georgia. Six foot, 180. 21. Old town, Savannah, Georgia. <laughs> All right. That's my oh, boy. Man. They sleeping on. I'm telling. We gonna be. We gonna snatch him up in the third round. Third <laughs> round. We gonna snatch him up. We got two. Hey, listen, guy. We got four picks in the first two days. Yep. Yep. But he can play safety too, to a degree too. He can play both. Nah, keep Matt Coleman. Keep Matt Coleman. Keep <laughs> Matt Coleman. He for Savannah. I got you, Draymond. I'm, I'm from Good Harbor. We got. A couple, we got a couple more people. We gonna finish this up though. I think one will probably wait over. So. Mm -hmm. All right, another linebacker. This is the first linebacker that come off the board, guys. Aaron Cooper. Yeah, he's gonna be the first linebacker to come off the board. I think. Not outside linebacker, a linebacker, linebacker. Aaron mm -hmm. Cooper, Texas A&M, 30, 23 years old, covers in Louisiana. So I feel mm -hmm. he's gonna be the first linebacker to come off the board. Yeah. So I could be wrong, but we're gonna see. All right, let's go to the next one. Let's go get out of here, guys. I know. Yeah. That's my safety. Yeah, I like Tyler him. Newman, safety. Yeah. I think he's one of the better safety we have right here. So he's uh, from Minnesota, 6'2", 210, age mm -hmm. 22, St. Charles, Illinois. Yeah. All right, so who I got next? Next one is a cornerback. Another good cornerback guy. Uh -huh. He's a little thin for me, though, but he's a good cornerback. Mm -hmm. uh, this is somebody I think the Falcon may look at also. Mm -hmm. That's cornerback wise. It's Enos Rakestraw Jr., cornerback from Missouri, six feet, 187, 21 years old. He's from Duncanville, Texas. Tough mm. cat. He always around the ball, man. He, he mm -hmm. knows around the ball, so this is another good person to pick yeah. up. And my last player. Uh, my last player. Bella, drum roll, dude. Last player. Last one. Y'all okay. ready? Ready. Jalen Pope, wide receiver. Last wide receiver. <laughs> I think this kid here yeah, going to get picked up early second, maybe. Mm -hmm. Early second, somewhere in the range. He, he's like he's a top wide receiver, man. So we'll keep this yeah. guy here. So we have a, another good wide receiver. So he's 6'2, 204, 20 years old from Lufkin, mm -hmm. Texas. Don't know if that's mm -hmm. that either, but yeah. Hey, man. That was my top 50, y'all. Mm -hmm. Y'all, who, who y'all see anybody? I think, uh, did I, y'all think I left off? What about uh, Purcell from Florida? That's the one. Uh... Yeah, I see him second round. Hold on, Cedric Ram Pran. Where you think he going? He's a second round pick, probably too. Another second round person, maybe even fall farther than that. Like I know, I you left. think he gonna fall farther than that? Let maybe. him let him fall on down. We'll get him with one of them third round picks. What about we're, we're, um, we're Braylon Trice? Braylon Trice. See, that's, I'm glad you said that. Braylon Trice is one of my guys that mm -hmm. I I think. Go to be on that edge of the bottom of the second, third round. Mm -hmm. I like I like him, but I think he's gonna be on the he's gonna be on the bottom edge of that uh what's called on that uh okay. second round. Second round. Second, okay. third round. Okay. Same as him uh Ram Pran. But that's another edge out there, you guys. Y'all gotta watch out for his name is Marshawn uh -huh. Keenan, uh -huh. kid from uh West West Michigan. He may sneak into that second round, which I, maybe. But Ricky Parasol, I have him pick uh, right. as our first third round pick he, okay. on one of my mock drafts. So. Okay. Let me ask you this one quick question. 
who is your late round gem that you uh think the, the Falcon need to pick? Oh, I got you know, I got everything. I'm ready for that. <laughs> <laughs> I think I asked everybody how late, yet. how late because my late round gym, uh, okay, any boy, it could be any, any my boy Brandon Jackson. If he's there on our last pick, I'm uh, going for him. That's the answer. That's but edge. also, there's a guy nobody nobody talked about. Nobody talked about this guy. He's a uh, another linebacker that I think will come in and help out because he's a middle linebacker. The mm -hmm. kid from Washington named Idamfu Euro Fossio. Fossio. Okay. Yeah. So those are my my diamonds in the rough right here. They're all from Washington. Not because I live here. I just watched the tape, man. <laughs> not not because I live here. But anyway, we finna get a guy here, man, because yeah. I know Warren's probably even on. He may be already going on. Oh, he's waiting to be out of here. Yeah. But uh, thank you guys for coming in and checking us out, man. If you haven't already, if you're here, make sure you hit that subscribe button, like this video, share this video out. Support yep. everybody on this AFN, GSN panel, man. And uh, don't forget, tomorrow morning, 11 o'clock Eastern time, my final mock draft, and I got some stuff to talk about. I want you guys to listen, discuss mm -hmm. it with me, mm -hmm. and complain. Because, like, where's that? I'm going to shake the tree just a little bit. He is. <laughs> just a little bit. Just a little bit. Yeah. It ain't going to be as bad as talking about running back. But anyway. <laughs> yeah. But uh, thank you guys for joining us, man. <laughs> Miss Pam. Hey, guys. Thank you. Y'all get that. Get that. Uh, shout out to Miss Pam for coming in here. Hanging out with me for this last hour. Y'all yeah. yeah. better leave Tyler LG alone. <laughs> <laughs> so, but uh, but uh, yeah, man. Thank you, Game Miss Pam. Big Will, appreciate you. Thank you. For sure, show, Miss Pam, you're yeah. welcome. Many time I'm on the show, so you want to hop on? Just go on to what's called, so you want to come on, and I will send you the link. Cause you you on the you on the what's called right? The regular page. Yeah. Okay, so I'll, yeah, I'll, we love we love your company. We love it. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so uh, again, guys, appreciate you again. Y'all have a great Thank day. You. Head over to the Atlanta Sports End Game with one over there mm -hmm. on uh, probably Matt Mike channel or yes. FM Zone One channel. My shoes on. Head over there. So I'm heading over to myself. Me too. Peace, y'all. Peace. Bye. Peace.